guests from the other side of Earth. Forest Grandpa had a globe, and he told Blue Fox, We all live on Earth. The Earth is round, and on the other side, there are many residents too. Blue Fox, Bobo Frog, and Green Grass Snake all wanted to go and see what was on the other side of Earth. They were particularly curious about what the residents over there looked like. Blue Fox came up with a great idea. Why don't we dig a tunnel? A very long tunnel that goes all the way to the other side of Earth. So, they all joined forces and began to dig. Meanwhile, Little Mole was fast asleep in his burrow. Suddenly, the roof collapsed and dirt tumbled down. Goodness! Is there an earthquake? Little Mole rushed out of his burrow. Hello, are you residents from the other side of Earth? Welcome, welcome. They surrounded Little Mole, giving him a warm welcome. Little Mole said, I'm not a guest from the other side of Earth. I'm a guest who lives underground. Blue Fox exclaimed, A guest who lives underground. Forest Grandpa only told us that there are residents on the other side of Earth, but didn't mention residents living underground. Our Earth is truly remarkable. Green Grass Snake invited Little Mole to his home to enjoy some fresh strawberries. They set up a table with luscious red strawberries and feasted until they had round bellies. After their strawberry feast, Bobo Frog invited Little Mole to the pond for a swim. Of course, everyone joined in the fun. They swam, had water fights, and had a blast. Blue Fox, on the other hand, took Little Mole for a walk on the grassy field and flew kites together. Little Mole was nearsighted, so when the kite got stuck in a tree, he couldn't see it. Red Squirrel climbed the tree to retrieve the kite for him. Little Mole invited everyone to his home to play, but the tunnel was too small for Blue Fox to enter. However, Little Mole was a tunnel digging expert and he called many other Little Moles to help. In no time, they had dug a wide and long tunnel. They all went through the tunnel to Little Mole's home. He treated them to peanuts and walnuts and taught them the round dance. Haha, ha, we're having so much fun at the home of our underground guests. Next time, we must dig an even longer tunnel all the way to the other side of Earth, Blue Fox said with excitement. He also warmly invited Little Mole, saying, You should come with us. We're sure to have a fantastic time. This heartwarming story emphasizes friendship and the joy of exploring new places. It's a delightful tale for young readers.